breakfast made. So my mom was feeling kind of under the weather, so she's going to be going back home, but we're going to stop at Mocha Joe's here and get a coffee, and then she's going home. We're going to head to on to Ure for the rest of the day. You need the restroom? Yeah. Where's it at? It says no public restroom. That's, that's a dumb sign. I hate that sign. <laughs> I go to the brewery, Jay? Yeah, let's get a beer. All right. Can we have beef bar? Sure. Nice like bar seats? Yeah. How are you today? Doing good. Good. Are you this is on the blackboard there with the first four or the ones we make downstairs? All right. The other two are guest tops. Camper Mom. Saison. Saison? Saison. Saison. And you got the red. 550 red. That's good. Your beer? Yep. And yep. we just finished. Right in time because we awesome. schedule things perfectly. <laughs> All right. Well, <laughs> or, you are right in time to go to the car shoot. Sporting the hat. Yeah. Jade's getting a new hat too? Yeah. Let's see, Jay. Is that it? Is that this the new is the one? Cool. Looks pretty sick. I think the string should be a little more better place. There you yeah. Go. <laughs> String's probably gonna come off. So River is planning a hot sauce, hot wings night, and he bought a bunch of hot sauce. So I pick up these two here to contribute to the evening once we get back. I thought you brought your own booze, not your own hot sauce. Oh, at River's thing? <laughs> well, That's what you said earlier, you always bring your own booze. I do, but I'm bringing my own hot sauce okay. too. You didn't okay. bring your own booze now. No, I, well, oh, fine, whatever. He he just, here. I did the All right, so we've spent roughly an hour, hour and a half hitting the stores. We broke off in teams and just told everybody to meet back at 3.30. But by the time we're leaving, it's four. But <laughs> you don't have to say that, John. <laughs> <laughs> we are now heading to the Box Canyon. But if you figure, unless you're really into shopping and you have a lot of money to blow, hour and a half to two hours tops is probably all you need to check out the shops. Um, now we're heading up the hill to the Box Canyon. See you there. We'll do that to you. So to get you guys up to speed, Candace is afraid of sharp edged mountains. She is. And she's freaking out because of this little tiny kitty slope here. You're the worst. Kitty slope? This isn't even the slope she was really freaking out about. It was way worse was than this. The road had washed out and undercut the mountain, and then they had to build it back up to concrete where it was. <laughs> Candace, you're fine. Candace, look at me. No. Look at me. <laughs> <sighs> you're making fun of 
comedy sadness. <laughs> Robin, does this really scare you? It did back there. Why would it scare because you? Because there was a, like this much room to the shoulder but of the road. But you know I've taken you on much um, worse roads. John? And he can't see. And I can't see. Oh, God. And I'm a much worse <laughs> driver than Jay. So you should be very desensitized to this by now. <laughs> And my kids are driving up this mountain. They'll be fine. They're not going to pass me, so they can't drive any dumber than I am. Listen, here. I'm hungry. I promise this isn't a nervous eating. <laughs> <laughs> like, if I don't look like this, sometimes you? I can't How see How about you, Nikki? Um, I yeah, am fine yeah. since I'm on this side. <laughs> oh, you're just not looking. Yeah. So there's not a shoulder. The shoulder is death. It's fine, Candace. Have some faith in your husband. Do you see it? No, he probably didn't put his contacts in. <laughs> You're doing great, Jay. Thanks. Great. Yet, Robin is the one that's oh, like, let's get up on the swing that goes over the Royal Court. And then I said no, and you did it anyway. Alright, so we're almost to the Box Canyon, and uh, it's going to be a really nice hike. Gabby wanted to see some waterfalls, and I'm really hoping that she is going to enjoy these. Or this. There's only one fall. So. Unless I push you. There's going to be two falls. <laughs> we, went, we went too far. Yeah, we, uh, <laughs> we went too far. Not so. Yeah. I'm getting chills. Yeah, Kirsten. All right, guys. So everybody's accounted for, I believe, right? So how far is our hike? Uh, not that far. Jacob. Ready, Jacob? Yeah. All right, Jacob. Look at this little monk. Oh, chipmunk. Oh, I love little chipmunks. <laughs> You could have got a real here. Take a picture of him because he's so close to you. I just want to pick him up and rub him and hold him. And eat him. They might have bubonic plague. What? <laughs> I don't think these guys do, but it is always a risk in nature. Look, John, your friend has his cool back. Yes, he does. He has his cool back. <laughs> I never lost it. I just rolled it out. You just loaned it out? You've got so much. That's why my mom could walk with yeah. such speed and briskness. Yeah. Because you loaned out your coolness? Yep. I see. It's better, Jacob. It's better. It's a lot cooler down here. Yeah, and this is all below. Yeah, probably. <laughs>
why we barely escaped with our lives. That was the Box Canyon Falls. Watch for birds, watch for bats, watch for pterodactyls. Oh Are you laughing at me? Yeah. I like it. It's very strenuous. I would do it if we have time, but if we don't have time. We have time. Go. If they want to do it, we have time. I'll, I'll just put it up to a vote when we're down here. I'm not going up there, John. Did you want to go? Did you say you wanted to go? I'm me? Okay. You're okay? I can go either way, but I... Because I, I guess our little group's going. Okay. So. I, think, I think there's a bridge up there. And you can always turn around there and come is. back if you get tired. Steep half mile. 200 feet elevation. Yo, what? You're going to run? Take a break. I'll catch up with you guys. <laughs> I should have tried to keep up with them. So this little trail here is 200 feet up. Half mile round trip. It will be very exhausting. Don't run it. That's why I'm exhausted, but I would have been exhausted anyway. Even six years ago when I did this, it was pretty strenuous. All right, I better catch up with the group. Jessica, I'm not going. I'm going back. Bye. So, there you go. Pretty strenuous chair, trail. Uh, more strenuous than anything I just did at the Arches yesterday. All right, guys. We're going to see you next at the Ure Hot Springs. Closes at 10 p.m. If you don't like hot, because it's really hot here in Colorado, which it is, rest assured, the URA Hot Springs has every temperature to suit your needs. It has a section that's like three feet or so deep that's probably 104 degrees maybe, somewhere around there. So hot, right? But then you have, it gets deeper all the way to the other end, which is I think 15 feet, whatever the depth needs to be for you to be able to jump off a about a 10 foot diving board. So pretty deep. And so when you get to that side, the water's pretty cool. Not ice cold freezing, but honestly a little cold for my taste. So again, check out the Ure Hot Springs, which we were about to go to. It'll have water temperatures to suit everyone's preferences. That's where I'm heading next. As soon as I make it down these steps, as long as I don't have a heart attack first. All right. See you there. Are you so excited to go swimming, Jay? Yes. <laughs> Wound up. Wound up. You'll like it. I'm sure. Because it's not cold. Watch him. Watch it be the cold. Watch the volcano be, you know, off. Done. They turned it off today. Yep. This is the cold side. And as it goes that side, it gets hotter. Okay, so 
this has changed quite a bit since I used to be here. This pool used to never look blue. It was like a, it had stuff growing on the bottom. It wasn't gross, but because it, it was a natural springs, you know, it was like, like mossy. This is our table. You know what I mean, like mossy. And it's not. It's now. It's more like a regular pool. But it's still the. It better well, be a hot there was spring. A thing I read somewhere that said that some pool or another here in town was filled in twice by rock slides. Oh really? Okay. Robin! Robin over here! To your right! I'm coming! Robin's blind, you know. She's just standing there all by her lonesome wondering what to do with herself. So Jay. Yes, sir. I'm a little disappointed in the pool. It's not well, how it used to be. It was cooler before. We're sitting and we're not driving. That's a nice change. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Very true. Well, we're sitting and you're driving. <laughs> we're not sitting in the car. We're looking at this. Yeah. This is pretty epic. I want to buy a whole $5 pizza all for myself. Dude, I'm hoarding it. Look at I'm hoarding it. A big yellow Jeep. But he, he gets some people out of some really tight spots. <laughs> so I just got going. What do you think? I love it so much. You like it? Yeah. All right. You like it? <laughs> Thank you. All right. So here we are. The only restaurant open at nine. It says nine. Oh. Probably 30. It does say 9. Sorry. Oh, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> it's a running joke. If we go everywhere, it causes them Never mind. <laughs> That's Brick House. There's Maggie's. Oh, everything, 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 else everything, everything, everything else is closed. closed. This was the only thing that was listed at 9.30. So we miscalculated something on scheduling. All the restaurants close at 9 o'clock here. So be aware of that. If you're wanting to eat, out of the pool by 7.30. Is True Grit still open? Well, this actually looks pretty good. Look at those fries. Spicy chicken sandwiches. Excited? Mm -hmm. Excited, Robin? Yeah. All right. Place open, Freddy's Pizza. This isn't Freddy's Pizza. God, I'm tired. Only a place open, Freddy's. What is this called? Freddy's. Freddy's what? Freddy's Frozen Freddy's Frozen And Steakhouse. Steak Boogers. Steak Boogers? Ooh. So, did you have a good day, Robin? 